What is going on everybody? My name is the Pokemon Master and today we are going to be opening up more Shining Legends booster packs. As you can see we have two Raichu GX boxes, two Zoroark GX boxes, and two Shiny Dark Ray GX boxes. That's a total of 30 Shining Legends booster packs. If you've watched the four previous videos on the channel you've known that these pulls on these packs have been absolutely phenomenal. We've already pulled the Secret Rare Test Tube Mewtwo, we've pulled the Rainbow Rare Mewtwo GX card, and we've pulled a total of three Shining cards. Let's hope that that fire stays with us today and as an added bonus for today's video I'm going to be announcing another giveaway so please be sure to watch the entire video so you do not miss out on the details for that. Alright guys I'm going to crack open all six of these boxes off camera to save a little bit of time and then I'll be right back with you. Alright guys we are back. Um, took a little bit longer than I thought. These uh, shiny Dark Ray GX boxes that you get from Walmart are wrapped in plastic too, so I had to tear those apart. But um, we got them all opened here. I think we're gonna do the two shiny Dark Ray GX boxes first. And good luck, us. All right. Uh, Genesec, Genesec, Genesec. So we'll save the Rayquaza for last. Pretty pumped to be opening up these packs, being that we're doing 30, nearly an entire booster box full. So, see if we get a little bit of first pack magic. Starting off with a Fairy Energy, Electrode, Lightbard, Energy Retrieval. Krakena, a Purloin, a Larvesta, a Litten, a Breloom, a Reverse Palkia, I believe that is new. We do not have that one yet. And we have a Mewtwo GX, so not a bad start at all. Look at that. <laughs> so I pulled the cards wrong and uh, yep, boom, glad I did. Second pack magic, Shining Arceus. We do not have this card yet and it looks phenomenal. Um, no sort of markings on the back at all, so that's good. The centering, top to bottom, looks good. Left to right, it might just be a hair to the left, but it's very minor. Um, the surface of the car looks absolutely great. The centering maybe a little bit to the right, so. And maybe the whole card has just shifted a little bit to the side, I'm not sure, but we do not have this card yet, so I guess we're excited to get that one. Being that we have all the commons and uncommons, let's see what we got. We got a reverse Croconaw. So I believe that's that's our fourth shining card and our third different one, so we're still missing three. But we will take it. Video off to a fire start once again. Got a reverse water energy, and I know I do not have that card, so that's nice to get. And a hollow mana fee. And then the last. Last pack in the first box. Got a reverse Voltorb and a hollow Raikou card. And this one is the opposite of the last box. We have one Genesect and three Rayquaza. It was the opposite in our last box, so. Got a 
Reverse Latios and a Hollow Keldeo. Reverse Sophocles and a Shining Jirachi. So our fifth Shining card that we've pulled on the channel so far. This is the third time that we've pulled this particular card. And this probably looks to be the best one that we've pulled. The centering is absolutely phenomenal on it. On the back side, front side as well. Maybe just a hair to the left, but other than that, it looks good. So in terms of rare cards that you could be asking for out of this set, Two boxes in, only six packs in, and we pulled two shining cards. Not a bad start at all. Got a reverse Incineroar, followed by, yeah, yeah, that one Pokemon. You know, the one that I don't like to pronounce. Yeah, pretty sure I, I pulled him in every video that we've done so far. All right, and then the last pack for the second box. Don't expect anything too rare, being that we've already pulled a shiny, uh, shining card, but you never know. Got a reverse Lily and a hollow shaman. So, two boxes in. Two shining cards. Excellent start so far. And then we'll crack into our first Zoroark box here. These boxes have five packs. Let's take a look. We got a Mew, a Rayquaza, a Mewtwo, a Genesect, and a bonus Mewtwo. All right. Oof, a little bit bent there on the corner as some of these boxes have been. Thankfully, it's just the front cards and no other cards in, within the pack. Got a reverse double colorless energy and a hollow Latios. Just want to thank you guys for your guys' support so far. Um, I've only been, I only started the channel just a few days ago and we're already up to, I think last I looked was 54 or 55 subscribers. So that's always nice to see. I was worried that I would have a hard time um, starting a channel out on YouTube, but it looks like there's already some beginning signs of good support, so I really appreciate it. Uh, if you guys could, if you guys like what you're seeing in our videos, uh, make sure to share them with your friends, your family, any other people that you know like Pokemon. Um, as the channel grows, I will be opening up um, different sets. I have probably about a dozen or so different sets. Most of them are um, sets within the past few years, just because the older sets um, prior to the X and Y series are just so damn expensive. Um, but I am, I do have my eye on a few different sets, so over time as the channel grows, I will be opening up rarer sets. So, got a reverse Ivy Store and a Hollow Shaman. So far, this Zoro Arc box is pretty, pretty average. Nothing special out of it yet. Maybe that'll change. Another bent card. Bulbasaur was bent in a couple of packs ago, and now Ivysaur was bent. Maybe we'll get a bent Venusaur. Got a reverse Ivysaur and a hollow Latio. So maybe a little bit of last pack magic for the third box. We can hope. Another 
bent card. What's going on here? Got a reverse Reshiram. I do not believe we pulled that card yet, so that's nice to see. And we have a Hollow Keldeo. So, third box, pretty average, but we're gonna keep on going here. This box has gotta be better. Genesect, a Mew, a Mewtwo, and we have two Mews, where we had two Mewtwo's in the last one, so. Maybe we'll get a Shining Mew. All right, grass type energy. What do they call that leaf? I don't know. I don't know what the correct trading card verbiage is for the energy cards. They're a little bit different than the handheld games, which I've been playing on since, oh boy, I don't know, 98. And we got a Raichu GX. So I believe the only GX card that we do not have, um, the normal GX card is Raichu and we now have it. So those are also complete. We're just waiting on the three shining cards that we have not pulled as well as um, the rest of the secret rares. I believe there's two rainbow rares that we haven't pulled. And then the Mewtwo um, full art version. I also believe we have not pulled yet. We've pulled the test tube Mewtwo and the rainbow rare Mewtwo, but not the full art one yet. So, in theory, what should be the easiest Mewtwo to get, we have not pulled yet. And hopefully it stays that way. Hopefully the next Mewtwo I pull is another test tube one. That would be amazing. And look at this. The Shining Jirachi pulls continue. <laughs> this is the fourth one that we've pulled. The second one in this video. Um, centering looks pretty decent. Uh, the back of it looks mint. Although it does, it looks like it, it looks like it might be tilted a little bit. If you look at the board, it's a little bit thinner up here at the top and a little bit thicker on the right. So maybe it's, maybe the centering is not so great, but Again, our fourth Shining Jirachi that we've opened, the third Shining card in today's video. So, I would say that the second Zoroark box was definitely better than the first one. Fire pulls on this channel continue. There we go. <laughs> if you've watched the other videos, you know how much I love this artwork. It's just hilarious looking to me. Um, got a reverse version of it and a hollow Palkia. There's that artwork. For Scraggy, I have a ton of those. And a hollow Keldeo. All right. Let's see some last pack magic here out of the fourth box. All right. Got a water energy for alligator, an incineroar, energy retrieval, an Ekans. Stunfisk. I believe it's the only fighting, um, fighting type card in this whole set. Uh, Pikachu, Bulbasaur, Totodile. Got a Reverse Electrode, and boom! How about that? Last pack magic, baby. Shining Genesect. One of the three remaining shining cards that we do not have. So um, this box had two shining cards in it which makes up for the third um the third box that we did that didn't have any sort of rare card in it so man fire poles on the channel continue um just want to use this moment as a quick reminder that if you are not yet subscribed make sure that you subscribe as soon as possible because if you are one of the first 100 youtube subscribers to the channel you are going to automatically get entered into a giveaway where i'm going to be giving away 
a Shining Legends Elite Trainer Box. Um, it is sealed, it's never been opened, came straight from PokemonCenter.com. So be sure to get in on that. Um, man, I was gonna wait towards the end of the video to uh, announce our next giveaway, but I think I'll take this moment to do it now. Um, if you guys could drop your comments below and let me know out of the three most recent sets that we have um, that Pokemon has released, um, being Sword and Shield, the base set, um, Rebel Clash, the second set, and then of course Darkness Ablaze, which is the current hot set, but it's about to go to the wayside shortly with Champion's Path coming up. Um, out of these artworks, which ones do you guys like the best, number one? Number two, let me know why you like a particular art set. And uh, I'm gonna choose one random commenter on today's um, video to send you a full artwork set. So you'll get either four Sword and Shield base packs, four Rebel Clash packs, or four Darkness Ablaze packs. Um, so let me know um, which set you guys like the most. I'm gonna guess it's Darkness Ablaze just because of the Charizard VMAX that you can pull. Um, although if you do like one of the other two sets, let me know that as well. All right, now that that giveaway has been announced, let's crack into the last, last two boxes. And the Raichu GX boxes have a total of five. was a Mew, a Genesis. I guess, guess we got three of those bad boys. All right, let's crack Genesect open. All right, got a Fighting Energy, Sophocles, a Lily, Pokemon Breeder, a Voltorb, Perlon, Litten, Totodile, Stunfisk, Reverse Carnivine, and another Mewtwo GX. This is probably the third or fourth time that we've pulled it. Um, I know it's the second time today, but still nice to pull one of those. fire going four boxes four shining cards maybe we can hit one of those rainbows that we haven't hit in one of the last two boxes that would be amazing a lily reverse and a hollow raikou i mean i i'm shocked at the at the pull rates that we've had so far with this set i know it's a smaller set so you're likely to um you're more likely to pull these rare cards but I didn't think it would get done this soon. I, I would have figured that the Shining cards, being that there's only six of them in the set, would be really hard to pull, but we've already pulled four, um, and we have two left, so. And then we've pulled um, a total of four of the Shining Jirachis, so that's kind of funny. Another Raikou. Energy, Scrafty, Float Soul, Warp Energy, Minion, Buzo, Wiesel, Buzel, who knows, Scraggy, Voltorb, Ekans, a Reverse Float Soul, and a Latios. Alright, last pack magic here, baby. Worked on the last box. Why wouldn't it last? Why wouldn't it work here? Reverse Sophocles and oh shoot, it's another shining card. A shining Ray Quazal. So we have hit five out of the six shining cards so far in the set. The centering does look a little bit to the right, but that's 
just fine with me. I cannot believe the pull rates that we are getting out of this set. Um, yeah, it does look a little bit shifted, so it's shifted to the left on the back, shifted over to the right on the front, but still, it'd be a nice addition to the binder. To the binder. Um, absolutely love the artwork on this set. I love Rayquaza, um, just as a Pokemon, so it's cool that it's included in the set. Wow, five shining cards in five boxes. What in the heck are we gonna pull out of the last box here today? Man. I was really hoping that the fire pulls would continue and I have been shocked as to how this is continuing. This is just nuts. All right, what do we got for artwork in this set? Two Mews, a Mewtwo, a Rayquaza. Oh, the best artwork. All right, uh, we'll save the Mewtwo's for last. Mew in the middle. We'll start out with my boy. So, wow. Last pack magic working, working double time, working overtime for us. Last two boxes, five boxes, five shining cards. What in the heck? There's no way that the six box is gonna have something. Our luck can't be that good. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Pikachu, a reverse purloin and a hollow hoopa. What on earth are we going to pull today? Reverse Pokemon Breeder and a Hollow Latios. Seems to be a fairly common card to pull. Alright, last Mew Pack. Ooh, Psychic. It's a Mew Pack. It's the Psychic symbol. We're we gonna pull Shining Mew. All right, so we got a Reverse Hollow there and just a regular old Hoopa. All right. Down to the last two packs. Come on, baby. All right. Start off with water energy. A lily. Carnivine. For alligator. A minion. Yeah, that guy. Abusal. Scraggy. Voltorb. An Ekans. A reverse Larvesta. And a regular old Shaman. All right. So, last pack magic. Can we get it three boxes in a row? I doubt it. Our luck's not that good. <laughs> I mean, it's been it's been ridiculously good so far on the channel, but I certainly not going to complain if there's nothing rare back here. Five shining cards in one video. I don't think I'm going to complain, including two that we have not yet pulled. So. All right, Reverse Voltorb, and the last rare is a Hollow Manaphy. So nothing in that box, but that's okay, we'll take it. Our luck on this video has been absolutely ridiculous. So um, just as a reminder, take a look at this art set for the Sword and Shield base set. Take a look at the artwork for the Rebel Clash set. And take a look at the artwork on the Darkness Ablaze. Let me know which one is your guys' favorites um, and why. And again, I'll be choosing uh, one lucky winner in the comments section. So if you need all the details on that, get back to the middle part of this video to check all the details on that. Um, thank, thank you very much, guys, for checking out the fifth video. And uh, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And until next time.